For those of you who missed the last few haul videos, I was at the old book barn this past week. Uh, they're how I got into comic books. I remember going there as a kid, digging through their long boxes, finding a bunch of comics to buy. Uh, it came to my attention when I was there this week, they're going, no longer going to sell comic books. And whatever's left at the end of the month is going to be recycled. So they had all their comics, 10 cents a piece. I purchased about 80 comics. Today, we're going to talk about one of those hauls. Stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future videos. Alright, so first up in this comic book haul, we have The Last Defenders. Uh, Casey, Muniz, and Smith. Uh, to be honest, the only character I recognize off of this cover is Atlas. But very nice. Uh, I can't wait to read it. Uh, this, of course, is number three of six Marvel Limited series from 2008. Uh, Casey Muniz and Smith were the creative teams. Up next, we have Nomad, number four, guest starring Captain America. Uh, Nomad, for those of you who don't know, was the second Bucky. Uh, the final chapter, 50 years of Captain America, 1941 to 1991. Very nice with the announcement that there was a Morbius movie coming from Sony Pictures and Marvel. Mid Rise of the Midnight Suns, Morbius number one, part three of six. It's not in the greatest condition. Uh, you got some tearing here, loose binding. Still nice to have nonetheless. We have Death Storm T minus three. Noma Nova the Human Rocket number thirteen guest starring Firestar and Night Thrasher. Very cool. I love this cover. Uh, very nineties esque. They always had this circle in the background with like a bag drop and characters kind of coming out of the circle. Very nice. We have Star Trek number forty three by Weinstein Purcell and Tango. Trapped. You got. Dr. Hank McCoy there, and Scotty, uh, and a couple aliens with, uh, I think that might be a Klingon ship in the background. Very nice. <laughs> this one, I'm going to be doing a video on this series. I have it on Comixology, uh, but I, when I saw this comic at the old book barn, I had to pick it up even though I already own it on Comixology. Uh, it's nice to have a physical copy. From Dynamite Comics, number two, Army of Darkness, Xena Warrior Princess. <laughs> For those of you who don't know, Bruce Campbell played Ash Williams in the Army of Darkness and Evil Dead series, as well as Atollicus in Xena Warrior Princess. And you got Xena in the background. She can't really tell the two apart other than the mustache and the little uh, little thing on his uh, under his lip there. Uh, I always loved Autolycus, the King of Thieves in Xena Warrior Princess. Really nice. The story plays out nice. I can't wait to do a video on it here on YouTube. Up next we have from Kevin Smith and Jonathan Lau, Green Hornet number two from Dynamite Comics. This of course was part of Kevin Smith's run on the Green Hornet. He introduced a new Green Hornet, which I believe was Britt Reed Jr and a new Kato. Then we've got, from the same story arc, Green Hornet number six. Of course, the Green Hornet is making out with the new Kato. Um, <laughs> pretty interesting there. I'd like to, like to see how that came about. But there you have it, guys. Another comic book haul from Come Again TV. Hey guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button right there so you can stay up to date on all things geek culture. Also, you can check out one of these two playlists right here on the side for more videos just like the one you just watched.